Hey everyone, Will McReynolds from KP9 Interactive, creators of WorldCast. What I'm going to show you today is how you can actually edit a model right inside WorldCast. Be it Printcast, Showcast, or Geocast, you can take a model, change its color and textures, and even remove objects. Let's get started. So if you're in the studio, we can. I'm going to show you real quick how you can do this. I'm going to show you how you can import an object, but also let's take this model here. So if you have a model in the scene, in this case, let's just delete this. And we'll go to sketch fab and this is where you can bring in any kind of object right so in this way i'll just put it in truck we'll go next we'll find that same tesla truck the cyber truck we'll import this into the scene and once we've done this we, we of course can move it wherever we want etc but we're just going to go to this little button that says edit model what this will let us do is look at every little object and texture that's on this truck so if i highlight this truck over on the right-hand side, we'll have this little tab that says Material. So here's where we can take off the map, so you can apply your own. So if you're a 3D modeler and you don't want to export the model each time, but you just change the texture, you just be able to change the texture in here very easy. In this case, I was gonna, I'm just going to uh, take this uh, button, I'm going to browse to a texture, and we can pick any texture we want. In this case, I'm just going to grab the stained uh, glass texture. And if I want to remove the tire, we can either go like this, but what happens is, you're just grabbing all the models, so you might not get rid of the entire thing, so what you can do over on the right hand side is look at the hierarchy of the different objects. Now if the model is done properly, it'll probably be labeled appropriately. In this case it is. So we'll, grab, we'll select this and we'll go uh, uh, tire front left, tire back left, tire back right, and tire front right. And now all the tires are gone. So all we have to do is just go file, save the studio and close. You can also export the, what you, this new creation as its own GLTF or GLB. In this case, we're just going to go file, uh, save the studio, and that new model will come in with the appropriate changes. There we go. So all I did in this particular case was I raised it up to match the original height with the uh, with the balancing uh, pellets that were off the window, and I just grabbed another. I grabbed a cinder block from uh, from Sketchfab and just put it underneath the truck. That's all I did, and that's how simple it is to create or edit rather, a, uh, a 3D model that is existing. So you can change the texture, change the color. And then one more trick I'll show you is maybe you want something to be a different color. So let's just go back here and go edit model again. Well, let's click the truck again, and we'll go material. We'll just turn off the map altogether. And now we can just go over here and go color. So maybe I want this to be red. And we can put emissive colors on it and, and stuff like that. So if you if you know what those are, then you can by all means do that. And that's going to make it more reflective, more metallic. So you can make it a little bit more metallic in the environment. And we'll just bring that back a little bit to like that. And we'll just bring that back into the scene. And we'll see that that color of the truck is now appropriate to what we chose. And we can see we got that metallic sheen on it as well. See the light hitting it there. So there you go. That's how simple it is in WorldCast to change textures, remove objects, and change color all from directly with inside WorldCast. And that applies for all three studios, Printcast, Showcast, and Geocast. I cannot wait to see what you create.